Good day to you ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another video with Crypto Ninjas. My name is Dale and for today's video, I want to give you a quick walkthrough of the Binance Web3 wallet. BNB meme season is happening right now and a lot of people are bridging from different chains, for example, like Solana or Ethereum to BNB to enjoy this moment and ape into some of their favorite memes. There are a lot of wallets and exchanges on BNB chain that supports trading meme coins, so it can get quite overwhelming. So I'm going to do a series where I guide you through how to use different tools, exchanges and wallets so you can trade memes better. For our first video, we're going to start with the big boy, the Binance Web3 wallet, a decentralized exchange and wallet integrated into the Binance app itself. They have a lot of features and programs that not only help you explore the meme space, but also the BNB chain ecosystem in general. But before we get into this video, I am not a financial advisor. I'm simply your guide through this vast crypto universe. So do your own research and be responsible with your own investment. Thank you very much. And make sure to use our Binance wallet referral code on the screen to get 20% off of the trading fees on your Binance wallet. And trust me, if you're a DGEN trading memes a lot, that can save you a ton of money as time goes. I did a video on BNB meme season up here. So if you want to check that out, feel free to. Now, this is the official Binance wallet interface. To access this Binance wallet, very simple. Just log into your Binance account and switch to a decentralized exchange. Okay, so how do you access this Binance Web3 wallet? Well, to start, they have two main products. Okay, first is the Binance wallet extension on your Google Chrome or your web browser. Go to you know Chrome Web Store and search for Binance wallet and add it to your profile. Okay, so that's one. Uh, the second way is you can go to the, the main Binance uh, exchange website at Binance.com, uh, create an account and complete your KYC. Now, if you don't have a Binance account, make sure to use our referral link down below to create one and receive 20% off of your trading fees for life and up to $100 in new user bonus, okay? After you created your account and complete KYC, next thing is you go to the trade tab right up here, right? And click on the DEX version, uh, which is still in beta, but everything, you know, is working out very fine. The first thing that you would want to do is you have to create a keyless wallet. As you can see on the right side, I have a Binance keyless wallet already set up, uh, but you, if you don't have it, uh, you can basically create it on this web browser alone, uh, or you can download the Binance app on your phone and create the keyless wallets and have it backed up using, you know, uh, your biometric and, and whatever. Uh, keyless wallets offer, uh, you know, the limit orders option for you to trade, right? If you were to, you know, import your wallet, like MetaMask or Rabi wallet into Binance, uh, you can still do it, but uh, some of the features will be limited. For example, the limit order that I mentioned, okay? It's only available for the Binance keyless wallet. So I always have it set up. After you have your wallet set up, uh, what do you do? Well, you have to deposit money, right? If you don't have it, you can click on deposit right here and you can deposit money directly from your Binance exchange, right? Uh, look at that, right? From Binance Exchange to your keyless wallets, very simple, straightforward. Or you can receive tokens via, via you know, addresses, right? Deposit like a normal MetaMask wallet, okay? Simple enough. Um, after you have your funds, uh, then the next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna start trading. Now, Binance Wallet support three major chains, uh, BNB, Solana, and Base, but obviously we're only gonna be talking about, you know, BSC. Uh, if you want to trade tokens on Solana, you can still do it, but keep in mind, the keyless wallet is, is going to be a new one, right? Look at the address, right? Different ones. And on the left side, look at that. Uh, there are several tabs like the uh, markets, uh, meme rush, trade trackers, leaderboard portfolio, and referral, which we're going to go through one by one. Uh, first is the market tab, right? Uh, which shows you trending, smart money inflows, and uh, alpha. So these are the three. Uh, what do they mean individually? So trending is self-explanatory. The tokens that are trending right now, um, based on you know their volume, uh, based on market cap, based on their gains, different factors, okay? Um, you can also customize it into different time frames, like uh, one hour, five minutes, four hour, or even one day. You can also set up filters for this, you know, trending and categories. Uh, and you can also set up a preset by amount uh, right in the right side. So for example, if I put in 0 0.01 BNB, that means uh, whenever I click on this, you know, lightning button, uh, it will automatically buy me, you know, 0 0.01 BNB, right? You can also set up take profit and stop loss order. So for example, if you uh, take profit, for example, then if the tokens that you buy goes up like 100%, uh, 
then you can sell 50% to get, get your money up, capital up, uh, right? Um, and you can also set up like a stop loss. So if it drops like 10% or 30%, uh, you can get out like 100%, for example, right? And when you apply, then every time when you click on this buy button, the, the, the limit orders, take profit and stop loss will automatically be applied when you click the button, this, the, the buy, right? So that's very nice. I, I use that a lot with my meme coins trading. Um, next thing is the smart money, but it's based on different options and different, you know, uh, metrics as well. Um, so the, the amount of, you know, in S, S flow, uh, the net inflow from smart money into this token, basically, um, you know, the buying, a difference between buying and selling over time. Uh, and, you know, the number of smart money traders who have traded this, you know, token uh, within the selected period, right? So if the, the token is on top, that means, you know, more smart people are trading this token, right? Uh, but it doesn't necessarily mean that it's going to go up, you know what I mean? But it's a good indicator for you to do your research. Um, so you can set it up in, in five minutes time frame. So you can see like, okay, what token is being bought a lot, it's being sold a lot. And then you can filter, you know, um, based on, you know, the, the, the top 10 holders, how much they, they hold. Let's say if you only want tokens that, you know, the top 10 holders hold 10%, you can do that uh, minimum or, you know, maximum 20%, the top 10 holders and the token age and everything, okay? Different options, you have to uh, obviously, uh, you know, set it up on your own, okay? Uh, there's no fixed thing to, to set. Um, and then there is also alpha. So the alpha is uh, a list of the tokens that are listed on Binance Alpha. Now the next tab is Meme Rush, which has uh, two modes, the all and fair mode, okay? Uh, the all basically tracks new meme tokens with instant updates uh, from, from, you know, for, for meme, right? The premier meme coin launch pattern being made For the fair mode, now fair mode is a little bit different because uh, if you look at the four memes uh, latest updates right here, the fair mode is evolved from Meme Rush, uh, now live on Binance Wallet, um, and trust wallet enabling whitelist participant uh, participation and ensuring a fair transparent environment what that means is basically uh, the only the people right only the people that are using the binance keyless wallet address and kyc are able to participate in the fair mode for all uh, that basically means everyone from for for me right you don't have to kyc anybody can just create it so that base essentially uh, splits, you know, uh, meme rush from Binance Wallet memes uh, into two categories. Like, do you want DGENs where, you know, you don't know who's the, who's the dev, the devs can be scammers, they can set up different wallets and, and launch new meme coins and scam people. Or do you want, you know, a more, you know, secure environment where only the, the users who are KYC'd and, you know, have Achilles wallets on Binance can create a token and trade the tokens. Like, what is your pre uh, preference, right? Now, how do you basically trade memes on this thing? Uh, very simple. Again, you can set up a fixed, you know, preset buy. Uh, so 0 0.1 BNB, and you can buy it immediately if you see it's, you know, interesting. Um, and you can set up your filters. So uh, again, I have a video on setting up the filters. Uh, if you want, you can check that out. But my filters are like this, you know, it's very basic. Uh, you can check it out. I, it, it worked out for me just fine. So, you know, my age is like maximum two minutes, obviously for new pairs on meme on all mode because a lot of memes can be, you know, born. Um, and then the metrics for the new tokens for me is like, I want at least $500 in volume, market cap $20,000 maximum, right? And for a transaction, I need at least two transactions. I, I, that's it, man. I need something, you know what I mean? I just need some activities to get me going. All right, if you want to trade meme coins on BNB chain, then you need to look at CZ, right? You need to look at his tweets. You need to look at Yihei. You need to look at Binance. Um, so how do you look at them? There is a social tracker. Look at that social tracker. So this is essentially tracking the tweets and the, um, you know, activities from your favorite X account. Uh, you can, you know, add uh, any accounts you'd like. So because I'm on BNB chain, uh, um, I only add the accounts from BNB chain people. Look at that, right? Um, and I have another setup where I add my favorite, you know, influencer on X who have, you know, great calls on meme coins. So I can just add them in here. Just give you an example. So you can see, you know, the latest repost, for example, uh, the latest post from CZ, because whenever, you know, CZ tweets about something, it can be turned into a meme, right? Um, so yeah, 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 so whenever CZ tweets, I look at the memes, if it's launching, 
uh, and you know if it's correctly like what CZ tweeted, I'm gonna ape in a little bit like 0.1 BNB or point you know, whatever it is, right? And I'm gonna have you know take profit and stop loss order set up. So whenever it's you know, again 100%, I'm cashing out my initials, whatever, right? So I, I have a system. Um, so that's it, right? About you know the the soldier tracker. You can also track wallets um, from you know top performers, right? Uh, like Cubsy, for example. Um, he's a, I mean he's he's a trader, right? He's a meme trader. He made a lot of money, but it's I feel like it's very hard to follow Cubsy because th these guys they get in a very low market cap and they sell instantly up to few seconds. And you know sometimes the data is not updated in real time. Uh, so you know it's just only a few seconds away can you know you can get in a very very different market cap than Cubsy or different you know mean people so what i suggest is um, you need to follow the people that you know constantly have good trades and good win rates and suitable with your style of trading okay you don't want people who are trading like constantly like hit buy and sell immediately in a few seconds you don't want people like that it's very hard to follow them right so i only follow the people that have great calls and they stay consistent and you know i can get in at a relatively similar market cap as them then i'm going to follow them wallets to see what they ape in right high win rate um that's it Th those are the tips right and you have to find those wallets yourself um so that's about the meme rush um about the fair mode yeah it's similar nothing else to say uh there is newly created and there is migrated rank so what is migrated rank you ask um it is basically a scoring system from you know binance wallet um Look at that, right? Uh, shows the relative uh, performance among the meme rush tokens, fair mode. It does not indicate any listing advantages. Uh, token score is calculated for market cap, price, holdings, and transaction activities. So if the tokens are you know, at the top, then it, it, it's more likely that the token is well distributed, you know, higher rank, higher point in, in ranking. But I, but, you know, I see this ranking you know, changes quite a lot. It's not consistent. For example, BNB holder, which uh, I I used to be a very big holder in, uh, it was in top three and now it's now top seven, and these guys are up now. Um, so yeah, yeah, it, it can change. It's a it's a reference. You don't have to, you know, purchase them if you don't want to. And that's it. You can also buy them here. Okay. Um, now, if you are trading on Binance Alpha, and you want to earn the app Binance Alpha points, then there is also a four X Alpha volume. If you want to trade in the fair mode right um, so yeah in only in the fair mode can you get the full x volume and yeah that's it uh, the next thing that you can do is uh, you can click on trade right and this will show up as a trading panel uh, as you can see i'm holding mainly aster and a few other meme coins but again this is not an endorsement uh, i don't want to shout out and um, yeah you can uh, basically it, it's similar to uh to just a you know trading panel uh, on the right side, uh, then you can you know set up buy, uh, buy market or limit order. Now again, this is only available for Keyless wallet. If you don't see the limit order here, that's probably because you import your wallet. Okay, so get yourself a Keyless wallet. Um, yeah, you can set up you know preset amount, and also you can set up the uh, you know the slippage, the gas fee, and everything. There are also different presets for you to you know for you to trade, uh, customize you know. Look at that, right? Sell setting and buy setting. Uh, this is my setting, by the way. Uh, I always put it at auto, instant. You know, I want you know, as fast as possible, and, and I turn on MBV protection. Uh, but that's it. You can also look at token info of the tokens you want to buy, a buy and sell anal analysis. Um, and yeah, pretty straightforward. Uh, what I notice is whenever I execute a trade on Binance Wallet, it, you know, it goes in instantly, very fast. However, uh, for the limit order, sometimes uh, when the price reaches my target, it does not hit because of the slippage is not enough or the price, you know, when it hits, but, you know, because of meme coins, it goes up and down very quickly. So even though it hits that price, but it's not going to execute, you know what I mean? So sometimes you have to, you know, uh, change the limit order or whatever. Uh, the next tab is the uh, trackers. So for these trackers, you can track, you know, people and live trades. Um, so like Kizu's famous people only, right? Or you can just click on follow people, right? Um, and like different wallets that you see are whales and people that you know have you know good trades and you can put it in put put their wallets into you know following wallets for example. You can put them in you know uh, the following wallets so add them in, and you can click on live trades or you can see the smart wallets and what they buy. Okay, for example, this guy bought Mob. Um, whatever uh, at 150,000 
you know uh, in, in dollars in market cap so let's see see boom all right it's it's going up to like 180,000 okay so that's that's pretty nice right in market cap see you can probably learn how to trade by you know just checking out these smart wallets um, and then after the tracker uh, there is also a leaderboard uh, showing you like which wallets are profiting like a lot but I, I rarely use this doesn't really matter um, because you know you can't you can't really follow them because if they already profit then what's the point right I want to get in on the tokens before they profit this much all right um, and then there is also portfolio where you can look at you know what you're currently holding uh, active positions uh, realized PL transaction history um, yeah pretty nice wins actually in seven days uh, referral so this is very nice I have a referral link which is this one and which gives you look at that I have a 30% commission rate and a few referrals right if you use my referral code I think you can get uh, a 20 or 10 yeah I think a 20% discount on your trading fees so I get 10% you get 20% um, I, I think that's fair right so use my link I'm gonna leave it down in the uh, description and and yeah again if you trade a lot on Binance wallet it's gonna cost you a lot of fees and with a 20% discount that's a lot okay and that's it for my video about you know Binance wallet guide uh, this is one of the many so make sure to like and subscribe to crypto ninjas for more contents like this uh, if you like trading on Binance wallet make sure to use our referral code for 20% off of your trading fees for life uh, that can save you a lot if you're trading you know meme coins right every day uh, thank you very much for watching and stay safe daily out